Acrobatka from Poland. And today I'm standing right next to an amazing, super strong, the strongest woman you've ever seen in your life, Yvonne Smith. Yvonne, thank yes. you so much for the workshop today. Yes. Uh, you are you're unbelievable. Welcome. And uh, I have to you. ask you, like, what do you do that you are so strong? Like, I don't know whether you go to gym maybe, or it's only your genes, or, or uh, I want to be like you. <laughs> Tell me, what do I have to do so, to be like you? So it's actually just a lot of pull, actually, because I don't do the gym because it's kind of boring for me. <laughs> um, so uh, maybe, I, I guess it's good for you to do some exercises, probably in the gym, but I always skip it actually. So I just train a lot on pole. I like to do different grips, different kinds of lift to let my body get used to the different kinds of stuff. Yes. All right. And uh, how about your pole adventure? When, when did it start? How did it start? Did you do anything before? Uh, I was a wall climber before. I was a pole dancer. Oh, seriously? So yes. Um, so I was quite into getting upside down. I was really excited about doing tr all the tricks upside down. And uh, I just trained a lot for myself. I watched a lot of YouTube videos uh, from Ona Kivela, from Bendy Kate, from everyone. And I really, they really inspired me also. It's all up to the big pole stars that I am, I am who I am but now. When did it start? Like, uh, how many years uh, ago? Four years, yes, four, four years. years ago. Yes, um, yes. And how, like, someone told you about pole dancing? Uh, actually, I was in a club and I was drinking some beers <laughs> and... Then I see my friend doing some tricks in a pool. I'm like, oh I want to try this. And then I did. And I, yeah, I spent the whole rest of the night in the pool. So I knew this was the sport I was going to do. Yes. Um, so you mentioned Bandicade. You mentioned Una Kivela. Do you yes. have like, your, like, the biggest idol? Your favorite uh, dancer? Yes, I think my idol is probably Marlo Fisken because she's just so much flow. And, when you see her move, it's not natural. It's not, <laughs> she's not real. Yes. Oh yeah, she's really good. Yes. She's really good. And what about this year? Are you have any big plans for this year? Uh, yes, I want to do the exotic competition because yeah. I've never done it before. Mm -hmm. So I'm training so you mean a little. Like chicken booty or? Um, maybe yes, maybe <laughs> not like a really Turk Turk, but maybe more like artistic exotic if that even exists, <laughs> but maybe like my own style exotic performance. I will try to make it something beautiful, I hope. Yes. Awesome, good luck with that. Yes, thank you. Um, is there anything you want to add to your audience, to your fans on uh, I'm not, Do I have fans? <laughs> <laughs> well, we have lots of them, millions of oh, them. Oh, cool, cool. So, um, <laughs> yes, I'm happy to be in Poland. I never thought of it before, but <laughs> yeah, that Poland. Was nice. <laughs> <laughs> nice one. <laughs> and uh, yes, thank you for attending my workshop and see you around. Bye guys! Thank you, thank you, yeah, thank, thank you, you so you. much. <laughs> thank you. Yeah. Ciao. Ciao. All right. <laughs>